Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Morning to everybody guys on the gold market. Uh, we see the same actions on the euro currency actually. Yes, this was also minor retracement here. Uh, but it seems that current upward bounce uh, will be not really very significant, at least currently. It looks like the minor attempt to make the retracement, mostly because here we see some acceleration down compared to the speed of this leg. And also take a look at the overall price action on this week. It was really strong and it's collapsed as a tail closing candle with a significant range. And it tells that uh, some real sending stands, uh, some real bearish action stands beyond this uh, drop. That's why it's more probable that after minor reaction here, some downward continuation could follow. We uh, still think that it really could be reaching of this area. Previous support, uh, 1316 area approximately. You can see confidence support that we have traded two weeks ago. Is taking the long position here. So also, there will be daily result. So on the intraday chart, on the four-hour time frame chart, uh, trend here stands bearish. On the intraday chart, guys, for our we yesterday have discussed this uh, A B C D pattern, this major pattern here. And uh, our suggestion was that market could reach its OP target around 1302, mostly due to the speed of the dropping here that we see. It's not where it's, this is not the choppy action. This is rather straight, and uh, in such circumstances, usually market shows uh, continuation and completion of the targets. Meantime, as you can see on the for our time from chart, market has reached the minor target 1325 this is cop so contracted objective point so this is just the 618 extension of the ab leg counted from the c point so this first target now it stands in response to this area and you can see probably here you could recognize kind of the hand shoulders pattern that's why uh, today we probably could keep an eye on the hourly chart if indeed this hand shoulders pattern will be will work and will start and will complete the target, it means that market could reach 1336 confidence resistance. Actually, we were waiting this level within the whole week because we thought that maybe on this dropping, uh, market will show some meaningful retracement, will form kind of the brand butter sale or something of that sort. That could lead us to take the short position. But within the whole week, we haven't got any trade retracement. And uh, right now, as market has reached weekly pivot support one and the minor target on the fall time frame chart, it really could happen that some retracement will will come. So, uh, but at the same time, guys, we do not call you to, to trade it on the long side. We do not call you to take the long position based on hand shoulders. This is not forbidden, guys, but this is just bring the, a more significant risk, mostly because um, that because on the euro currency, we think that maybe market should proceed lower. For example, butterfly here could be formed. Market indeed could just start dropping and hand shoulders could be erased. Because on the euro currency, it's a bit different uh, shape stance. Uh, besides, uh, we are mostly watching for a possible taking the short position here with the downward continuation. And this is where treating right, right now is a retracement. So if retracement will happen, we will think about the taking the short position. If we will, will not see, of course, it's such kind of action here. So it will not be some frosting action right, right to the upside. Uh, that's why, uh, from that standpoint, we are mostly watching for this retracement as a tool to get the better price, not as an object for trading. But this, of course, not forbidden. If you still feel confidence and you would like to take the part in this trading of the hand shoulders, you could do this. It's no problem, actually. Uh, so the target of this patient stands approximately 1336. So as soon as market will get there, uh, here we could think about taking short with the downward continuation. If market will erase this hand shoulders, will inspection will fail, market will drop below these lows, it will just mean that market is coming to OP target around 1302. 
well, uh, so that's approximately what we could watch for here on the gold market. But the situation stands a bit tricky because um, on the euro currency, market stands very close to daily oversold, and it has very small potential to reach the bottom. So it's not, it doesn't have the significant uh, downside room to dro for dropping. Although on the gold market, you can see this room exists and market really could drop further. So it means that maybe it will be different pace of the action or something will change within the today's session. Um, since the short-term expectation on the euro currency and the gold market looks a bit different. So on euro currency, as I said, we expect that some kind of another leg down should be formed. Uh, and there were then some retracement could start, but on the gold market, you can see retracement already stands on the way. And uh, it's still unclear how to combine this uh, together because it's a bit in opposite direction sections. So that's why, uh, since we are mostly watching for bearish action here, uh, to avoid uh, not necessary risk, we do not call it a trade. This is up on the long side. Uh, but anyway, uh, major conclusion as follows that market has reached a minor target, and this is just respect to this target yet, so we would not treat it yet as some major reversal. So mostly we are watching on this like uh, some kind of the respect and minor retracement first. Uh, because this ABC patient is still valid, and indeed some downward continuation could happen, not necessarily today, maybe on next week. Uh, 